we greet our andunulapam readers in the mighty name of the lord jesus it's 24th of july the monday in 2023 today let's meditate on the topic the spirit will speak for with stammering lips and another tongue he will speak to this people from the book of isaiah chapter 28 verse 11 Our loving Lord takes pleasure in speaking to us openly as God is spirit we cannot see him face to face but he speaks to us in many different ways he speaks to us through nature through scriptural verses through dreams through visions and also through tongues when the Lord wants to turn around the life of a person he first turns his tongue because the lord knows that by turning the tongue of a person the direction of his whole life can be changed the tongue of a man is similar to a bit in a horse mouth to a rudder of a ship and a steering wheel in a car when a person receives the anointing of the spirit the lord uses his tongue to speak in unknown languages he speaks words of faith and in heavenly language when lord jesus ascended to heavens he comforted his disciples and said to them but the helper the holy spirit whom the father will send in my name from the book of john chapter 14 verse 26 he also comforted them and said that the holy spirit will stay with them forever the scripture says on the day of pentecost they were all filled with the holy spirit and began to speak with other tongues as the spirit gave them utterance from the book of acts chapter 2 verse 4 and these signs will follow those who believe in my name they will cast out demons they will speak with new tongues from the book of mark chapter 16 verse 17 you should receive the anointing of the holy spirit and the gift of speaking in tongues by earnestly asking the lord the scripture says for every one who asks receives once a believer read the following verse that says god anointed jesus of nazareth with the holy spirit and with power who went about doing good and healing all who were oppressed by the devil for god was with them from the book of acts chapter 10 verse 38 and he was filled with joy he immediately sought the presence of the lord and earnestly prayed to be filled with the same spirit the lord also was willing to fill him with the gifts and power of the holy spirit children of god do not stop with just speaking in tongues also ask the lord for the interpretation of tongues through which you can understand what the lord is speaking through that gift the lord will use you for the edification of the church verse for further meditation from the book of romans chapter 14 verse 17 for the kingdom of god is not eating and drinking but righteousness and peace and joy in the holy spirit today's bible reading meditation for morning from the book of psalm chapter 35 and chapter 36 bible reading for the evening from the book of acts chapter 25 20